I understand you're also a graffiti writer. <laughs> I for used to a, be. A of time. <laughs> and I also want to know how you got into that and how that has affected your art as a whole. Well, yeah, growing up in Astoria, I had a really strict Greek dad who um, wasn't really accepting of my music. Um, he was wasn't he won he had other plans for me although he's a great man and I, I love my dad he's great but um he had other plans so I I I played a lot you know in my my room um when he thought I was doing homework I was just writing lyrics down and poetry and stuff and there were times where he was so unaccepting that he would even throw away my music um my instruments so he so um I had a hard, hard time when I was in high school and um and then he threw away some of my paintings too. So I went out and I just painted painted some walls. I, I, you know, he can't throw that away. So <laughs> I just went around this, the town and wrote my name everywhere. And at the time, there wasn't any MySpace, there wasn't any Facebook, there wasn't Twitter. So that was so, kind of a way to get my name out there. Um, so that's how that came about. But I don't do that anymore because I started getting in trouble. <laughs> Now, you are in a band called the Freelance Whales, you play the bass. You guys are becoming huge. You are huge. 